Okay, now it's really important that you listen carefully here and get this right. Okay, distribution or distributing your uh, study throughout the day is very, very powerful. And, and as I previously said, you know, having uh, 10 study sessions in a day is better than having eight. Having four is better than having two. Okay, the more sessions we can have, the better. One of the reasons is we want to get to these little mini forget and mini aha moments where we just slightly forget a concept and then we read it and go, ah, oh, that's right. And then as soon as we do that, we go, we say it out loud, say it out loud, or we grab out our model and we, we do that, or we use one of our other memory techniques. At the moment, we have these aha moments, and that becomes a very powerful memory strategy. And what you want to do is, the reason I wanted you to listen carefully here is, you don't want, it's not like people who want to go, ah, oh, chocolate's healthy, so therefore I'm going to eat chocolate, because dark chocolate's healthy or something. You don't want to go, ah, oh, okay, Matt said forgetting's good. No. Okay, I didn't say that. What I said is having little mini forgetful moments where you um, slightly forget and the memory gets jolted is great. Okay, if you can't do that, then what I'd rather you do is just keep studying and having no forgetful moments. But if you can time it out and distribute it during the day and you're getting those little moments, then they're going to be fantastic. Now the other thing is this, I never ever want you, once you start saying, right, I'm starting for my PPL and my PPL exams in three or four weeks, I never want you to go 24 hours ever, ever, ever without studying, okay? You have to study every 24 hours. And and if, you, if you're running really short on time, then maybe first thing in the morning and last thing at night, maybe twice during the day, duck in, grab a final prep exam um, or skim read your book or whatever, and you know, don't even do the questions. Just go quiz summary and do a quick squim read and use the memory techniques as you're doing it. You know, say it out loud, scribble some notes, um, whatever. But never go 24 hours without doing some form of study and ha so, so you can have some mini aha moments on at least some of the content and you can skim read the other content.